real quick. What's everybody doing today, man? Just spark up. In the meantime, while I'm doing this, man, you could just make sure you subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and I'm saying anything to support the page. You see what I'm saying? Bomb, drop a comment. You know what I'm saying? Anything, man. Show some love. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what you think. You know what I'm saying? You don't agree with me, but you don't got to necessarily agree with everything I say. You know what I'm saying? You're going to find people who disagree, people who disagree, people who think the same, people who think different. You know what I'm saying? So we just here to let everybody just have a free mind of, you know, saying what they want. But today, man, we're going to get into this Quando Rondo situation, this little Dirk situation, this little King Vaughn situation. You know what I'm saying? This this whole Chirac, you know what I'm saying? Georgia Savannah situation, you know? And this situation a little different. That's how I want to talk about it. You know what I'm saying? And what I want to know is, do y'all think Quando Rondo... And Lil Dirk is in a Tupac Biggie situation, Snoop Dogg situation. You know what I'm saying? Because there's a couple rappers involved. That's the same situation with Tupac. It was a lot of rappers involved, a lot of top dogs involved. It was a few people, you know what I'm saying? Diddy involved. It was a few people that was involved in that situation. And this situation, there's a few people involved too, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to just get into it and try to dissect this thing and you know what i'm saying just just giving our opinion on what we think about the situation and first of all rest in peace to king vaughn he was a good artist he made good music and we wish quando rondo the best you know what i'm saying straight up but what would you do in that situation? You know what I'm saying? And I think most people would have reacted just like how Lil Tim reacted. You feel me? Enough people that I just do the same thing, dog. You feel me? I said so. In a real situation, you have to just defend that. Dog. That's what they talk about. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody got to have a shooter. You know what I'm saying? You're a rapper. You got to have your hitter. That, that's what they talk about. That's what that's, that's I bought. You feel me? I said, everybody a top shot, a top dog. You see it? Everybody think I'm a mother and crazy, so yeah, we can't really be mad at him and we can't blame him. You know what I'm saying? It's sad somebody lost their life. I think King Von them would have did the same thing. You see what I'm saying? I think if Quando was beating King Von, you know, beat him up or whatever, I think Lil Dirk would have got in and probably reacted the same way. Anybody would. So, you know, but it is what it is, and there's nothing you can really do about it right now. That little Dirk is in a tough situation, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, me, I feel as though Quando would be like Snoop Dogg. King Vaughn would be like Diddy. Except Diddy didn't rap at that time. But put... Imagine Diddy rapping. So King Vaughn would be like Diddy. Lil Dirk would be, say Biggie. Um, say Quando, Snoop Dogg, right? And, or Tupac, or say NBA Youngboy Tupac. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, damn. Now, they lost Diddy. Now you got Biggie and Tupac going at it. You know what I'm saying? And I, I don't see I don't see him like losing their life after all this madness. Because especially Quando being a crip, like, and they just lost Nimsy Hustle. So if Quando died, this would look bad for a whole crip nation. I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? It's like nobody even want to be crip no more. It's like, damn, y'all letting all the legend die. Come on, y'all got to protect him out here. You know what I'm saying? So that's a, that's the next thing. You see, he linked up with Big U. You know what I'm saying? But 
Lil Durk, he a legend in the streets too. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he got the whole BD thing going on and they heavy everywhere, just like the Crips. And, you know, for them to let King Von and then it happened, it's kind of the same thing. But we used to, you know, hearing so much happen. This happened, this person died. In this situation, it's a little, it's a little different. Because it's not like Chirac artists versus Chirac artists. It's not like Chirac Savage versus Chirac Savage. And I'm saying this is a whole different state. And I'm saying Georgia. You know what I'm saying? Which you could basically say Atlanta. So it's like basically Atlanta versus uh, Georgia versus Chicago. Even though Lil Dirk cool with Lil Baby and all of them. If something happened to Quando Rondo today. It ain't going to look good for those artists. You know what I'm saying? To know that, damn, y'all let a whole different side come in here and rob them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, you know, they they, they going to have to try to catch him out of town. It ain't going to look good to try to do Kondo something where he from. And the artist then where he from is basically like co-signing with it. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So I don't know. That's gonna be a problem. I think them artists gonna to have to pick sides. She either you from the south or you from Shire. I'm saying it's like it's they gonna get like that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all little dirt now, little dirt. You got ties with a lot of people. He been doing this thing. You already know the three hundred. You know what I'm saying? Chief Keith. They they, they heavy in the game. And his hands is basically forced. They force his hands, you know what I'm saying? So he's in a crazy situation where it's like he has to do something. He has to react. We're not saying he's going to react today, tomorrow, or next week, or next month. This shit could be a year from now, two years from now, you know what I'm saying? Especially him and King Vaughn had a case going on. A shooting case at that, you know what I'm saying? I'm not quite sure if it's a murder case or attempted murder, but I know it was a shooting involved where they pulled up on somebody at a store or something and shot that person because that person, you know what I'm saying, violated. You know what I mean? And them do some things that they're not supposed to do on the black and red. And dog, them never really, dog, them never had a really a feel that. So you don't know a jungle justice. You see what I'm saying? But unfortunately, they caught him on camera. You know what I'm saying? So King Von passed away. So he, ain't, he don't got to deal with that situation no more. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, the niggas going to have to stand up and show but they really about in the situation. You know what I'm saying? It's like Crip don't have to stand up and defend Kwando to show me and Crip stand together as a nation. You know what I'm saying? Lil Dirk, he gonna have to try to do something. He gonna have to do something to show that man he gonna have to live up to what King Ron say. And we already know what he say. If I, mm, my gonna slide, he already know the rest. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm saying. It's like them can't really make nothing happen to Tupac, and them can't really make nothing happen to Biggie. Cause if they let something happen to Biggie and Tupac, which is Quando and Lil Durk in this situation, the whole rap game would change. Like this, this is a time right now where it's going to change the whole rap game. From from that. You know I'm saying rappers going to have to move around a little different. It has to be more alliance. Has to be more love at the end of the day because at the end of the day we don't want them to be out here killing each other when they're supposed to be making millions of dollars because if if Lil Durk go shoot up Kwando's show and stop Kwando from coming and performing and Kwando goons them gonna do the same and Lil Durk gonna lose mad money so I don't even think Lil Durk will go try to shoot up his show just for the fact that he don't want that retaliation on his show when he got more money to lose at his show uh, you know, the people them with the money once the shooting involved at a event, it's it's a wrap. You're gonna lose all endorsement, all sponsorship. I don't think Lil Durk ready to risk that sponsorship. Just be for real, because you can't have shoot if you ain't got no money. You know what I'm saying? And you're gonna have to be able to buy your, your tool. You have to buy your tools. I mean, you know what I'm saying? So how you gonna have an army? You gotta have a weapon. You gotta have a soldier. You gotta be able to feed your soldier, house your soldier, transport your soldier, everything. You know what I'm saying? Like your soldiers and them just there putting in work, whatever the situation is. So I already see him 
risking all them big sponsor right now. Maybe later on, I don't know. And if they do something crazy, they gonna what gonna happen to them is just like what happened to GS9, Bobby Smurd and them. How they hit him with the whole Rico act, the whole yeah, they gonna if them boys not smart. Cause let's not forget Lil Reese and all of them, everybody coming out saying they're gonna do this, they're gonna smoke them like a blunt and all this stuff, but they're gonna do it a little tim. If that all that really happened, they could hit them with the conspiracy, the whole Rico act, all that. You know what I'm saying? But I don't think them Chirac goons and them savage cure anyway. But I'm just saying this what this what would happen if they you know what I'm saying? It's cause and effect. Even though they're not care, but it like a them don't care, but it's still like a and down here there. Quando them know. Of course they put they doing work. You know what I'm saying? They involved in a whole bunch of criminal activity. I'm involved in other streets. They might be a dirt, be a things that go on. So I mean I say. I must say, I must say, I must say, look at TV get shot up about four times that night. That little King Von got shot. So it's a whole bunch of shit going on that we don't even know about. It's a lot going on behind the scene that we don't know about. And I'm saying we ain't gonna forget about, you know, King Von baby mom. She, you know, what I'm saying, or whoever King Von they say he, it was, it, it started with the chick, I believe. Thing, this whole thing started with the girl you know what i'm saying and just like in any situation it always started with a woman you know what i'm saying to deceive make you eat the apple cast us in sin you know what i'm saying so that's what happened and it's just sad bro you so i'm gonna know a looking at it like man can't go out. They just lost a big fucking crib legend. Nimsy, rest in peace. Rest in peace, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Low dirt, they just lost King Vaughn. You know what I'm saying? It's it's really hot right now. It's really hot, man. I could see the people going to jail, like, or some shit, bro. Because it's the eyes is on them. You see what I'm saying? So I'm not saying, yo, they can't get away and they can't do things. Come on, dog. You don't know the streets work already. I work while working on the streets and I'm a chicken meal jerking on the streets and I want to sleep in the streets and you see what I mean? I said, when I work on nobody time, so I have enough time. I don't have time for doing anything that I want to do. You see what I mean? I said, I will never sell out for a time. You see what I mean? I said, I will not have a time. I will do anything I want to do it for a time. If you know what I mean, for one time, time not one way. Alright. So I'm gonna just I really wanna say the two artists them keep it off the public platform. If they beefing man, keep it in the streets, man, keep it off the social media, keep it off, off the feds reach. You know I'm saying even though the feds are more already on it, but keep it low key, man. We don't need all these people in jail. You see already top in jail, all of them in jail. We don't need to hear Lil Dirk in jail. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or Lil Reese in jail. Or Pondo in jail. Or we don't need that, bro. Lil Beef in school. But this ain't rap beef no more. This is straight. Street war. You see what I'm saying? And... I just think it got too public and I don't even know, man, honestly. You see Lil Timmy out, that means he gonna beat that case cause they gave him bond. They only give you bond when the evidence is strong in self-defense. And I'm saying when you could prove to them like, yo, this is a self-defense case. Yeah, they give you bond like in Timmy's situation. You know what I'm saying? So I could already see him beating the case. And I could already see him doing video court for now until he beat the case. <laughs> and then they keep piping it up so them boys gonna get rich overnight you know what I'm saying it's a sad boy so we just we just had up on the lookout right now dog it's gonna be a much summer you see what I mean I said this is so a ton of dog this summer gonna be mad you see what I mean I said stay safe dog stay with it dog and get caught locking without it you see what I mean I said you don't know I'm grown 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 
that the man them say on the dirt. You see what I say? Yeah, dog. Yeah, man. That the only boss I'm on the dirt. So you have to make sure you stay up on the ground. You see what I say? Yeah. So all this I look out like my come through the window, them all day every day, you can't trust nothing. You shadow nothing. You see me? Yeah, man, me tell us, I'm going bring you all of the exclusive news, them right now, and just I go and tap into it. So right now, we just go and drop some comment. Let me know what y'all think, man. Let me know if this situation will remind y'all of the whole Biggie Tupac era, the whole. You know what I'm saying? Shook Knight Hero, the whole bad boy. That, let me know, Death Row. You think it's going to get like that? You think there's going to be a, a South versus Chicago war? You know what I'm saying? Let me know, man. You think Lil Baby and them going to have to pick sides soon, man? Let me know, man. Yeah, because Quando, this situation can't be peace. It just it, it is what it is. It can't be no peace. Oprah can't peace this. Obama can't peace this, man. It just, it is what it is, man. You see me? Man, them just have to just get up the money, get them troops up and tough up the thing. You see what I said? Because the Chirac goons them now play with the thing. You already know them going with them thing already. I'll be a bag of things they man to deal with. You see what I said? Yeah, man. So right now, I have to see if this, the, 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 the goons them have to tough it up. But right now, let me know what y'all think, man. Who up, man? Who winning right now with the Chirac, Georgia, Savannah thing going crazy, man? You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. It's the unexpected that happened, man. It was unpredictable with this one. Nobody never said that one year for our deny place. <laughs> you see me? Yeah, man. So right now, first my day I get first, so go on, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and just let me know no one thing. Go watch the other video, then. It's all fun, man. Till next time. You see me? Yeah.